and I'm here to talk to you about correcting MIDI notes in GarageBand. Now when you record notes in MIDI on GarageBand, you may find that not everything you recorded was the way you wanted it, but fortunately, MIDI allows us to move those notes around and adjust them very easily. If you want to edit a particular MIDI piece, double click on it, and below you can see an area where you can edit the different notes. So there are more than a few different things you can do to adjust MIDI notes. One thing you can do is move them so you can actually change the note that's being played. So for example, we have this note here, which I can change by clicking it and dragging it up or down till I get the note that I want. I can also select an entire area and then move that area up or down. Another thing that I can do is change the length of a note. Let's say I don't want it played for this long. I click on the side here, and then I click and drag and pull over till it's a much shorter note. So let me show you how that sounds. So here's the short note. And then I can click it and make it longer. I can also affect the velocity of a note. That's how hard the note's being hit. So over here, where it says note velocity, I can change that value. Let's say I bring it up to 114. Play it again, much harder. Or I can make it much softer. Bring it down to 25. You can barely hear it. Another thing I can do is affect the pitch. If you look over here, there is zero change in the pitch. But as I drag this up, I can raise the pitch up quite a bit. Let's hear what the note sounds like now. It's higher. Now I can lower the pitch. And you can do that again with entire areas.